Do you want to die? Hmm? No! Seriously? It's set to burn? Hey, thank you. If you hadn't said anything, I absolutely would have been toast. So, uh, I didn't know that there was anyone else in here. You got caught too, huh? Guess it's not our lucky day. But this is perfect. Look, I know this is a weird thing to ask someone you just met. But I'm looking for someone. Maybe you know her. She's Uchiha clan's... Are you even listening? I don't need to. It has nothing to do with me. Hey, wait. Nanashi! So what? Huh? Oh, wow, it's you! So this is where you were all this time. Man, what are the chances, huh? I'm glad, though. I'm glad I ran into you. Okay, first objective accomplished. Next, we just need to get out of this place together. What? You don't think that we'll be able to get out? Don't worry. I can break down the bars of this cell with my jutsu. You can leave on your own. Huh? I'm a weapon. I only exist to fight for the clan. Use my jutsu as I'm ordered and destroy the enemy. I don't cry. I don't react. I don't run. I bear through the pain, then I die. I wait in this prison cell until I receive my orders. I don't go outside no matter what. That is my mission. I must follow these orders. Or I... Or I... No. You're not meant to be living in this sad and dark place. You're not just a tool for war. You have to walk down your own path. I... I... There's no way. I can't let them do this to you. I'm gonna get you out of here. I don't know exactly how all this works. Jutsu are blocked in here, I guess. She's been locked in here all this time. I'll break it open. <clears throat> You don't quit! My dad knows this well. That's how he made it so far! And now me. I've come this far... ...because I won't give up! Stop. Knock it off. I've already given up. I'm ready for things to stay. Don't give in to some fate someone made for you. Deciding for yourself. Shaking it yourself. And all of that is what makes it your own fate! Long isn't in here. Why? Why are you helping me? What was that? It came from the cell! Damn it! They must have noticed that. Time to go! <laughs> they broke the seal? Who could have done that? Could it be the Senju? 
Then are they after Namasi? Don't let Nanashi get away. Capture her at any cost. Once we're free, no one's ever gonna use you again. But... Uh... Don't worry. I'll protect you. Until we get somewhere safe. <sighs> Nanashi! Trust me, okay? She's not here! Keep looking. She couldn't have gone far. <laughs> there! No! You're that kid from before! Oh, you'll pay for this. Where's Nanashi? Beats me. We ran in different directions, so I've got no idea. You were both seen escaping together. It's no use trying to protect her. We got separated along the way. She's not here. Hiding her won't do you any good. I told you, I don't know where she is. <laughs> You've got some guts, kid. But you shouldn't be messing with adults. I wouldn't tell you even if I knew. If I tell you, her life will become miserable again. She's not miserable. Her existence will bring us victory. Fighting for your clan is what makes a true ninja. You treat her like a weapon. You don't even see her as a ninja. How do you know that? However, that is the fate of those born during this age. Those who fight as ninja. Those who are used as weapons. The give-and-take relationship makes the clan stronger. Then it's okay if it means someone's life is ruined? That's war. I'm not gonna let you do it. I'm never gonna let you make her... ...suffer again! Just hurt him. We'll make him spill where Nanashi is and which clan he belongs to. Yeah. Kill him! Blows are too much. So, this is the Warring States period. I hope she got away.
he... He just helped me on a whim. It was just by chance that he happened to save me, that's all. Nothing more, nothing less. So I just need to run away. There are no good people in this world. Why don't you give up already? I'm not done! <laughs> I figured. I haven't known you for long, but I can see that you're quite the ninja. I think it's time. Out of respect, I won't hold back. Fire Damn it. This is it? It's fine. As long as she got away. I knew it. Why? Why'd you come back? While I was here fighting, you should have just run! I don't understand. I don't understand why either. But... but... Whether it was by chance, or just a whim, till now, there's been nobody. No one's ever helped me like this. And... Nanashi. You know what will happen if you go against us. Uh, uh, there is a heavy punishment for treason. Understand? I... I... <laughs> Shut up already. Nanashi's not yours. Don't you get it? She doesn't belong to you. Not any longer. Nobody ordered her to do anything. She chose this. She chose to come back on her own. And she sure didn't come here in order to fight you. It's so she can walk her own path. <gasps> Don't give in to some fate someone made for you. And besides, a path will always open up for you. As long as you don't quit! Deciding for yourself. Making it yourself. That's what makes it your own fate. <sighs> Nanashi. Yes. If shaping it myself, if deciding it for myself, if doing all that is making my own fate, then choosing to fight alongside you is also my decision. Why are the words from someone I just met making me feel this way? Well, I still don't understand it. But... Out of all the people that I've ever met, you are... Your words are different, and for some reason, I felt that. That's why. From here on, I am going to fight for my own fate. Just watch. Nanashi? Your hand! Yeah. Yachihoko? Whoa! That's all the chakra I gathered. I've given it to you. Can you fight? <laughs> yeah, you bet. Of course I can. We'll win this! Now we have to face Nanashi? It's tough. But we 
can't let her get away. This will be the final fight. Let's go. Damn it! I wasn't expecting Yachihoko. Be careful. If she used Yachihoko, that means that kid has a lot of power. Nonosin! Who said you could do that? Nobody did. None of she decided this for herself. She doesn't need your permission. She's free to do what she wants because she's human. None of she isn't some weapon for you to control anymore. None of she, you okay? Get away. Get away. I'm okay. I'm okay because I have you with me. Let's go knock him around some more. Got it. Go. Fireball Jutsu! Don't get cocky! One on Here goes! Now she's freedom is right in front of us. It's finally right in front of us. It's right here. I can't lose at the very end. That'd be so lame. We're gonna beat you and open up a true path for Nanashi. That's what I'll do. Here goes! Here goes! Here goes! Now that we're here, I think we'll be safe. I can't believe it. Did we really get away? Yeah. Now you're finally... You're free. Free? <laughs> That's all I can do. What? You mean... you're not going to come with me? <laughs> Sorry. I can't tell you the reason, but I won't be able to go with you. Well, tell me. Who are you? I can't go into the details about it. Let's just say... I'm someone who wanted to free you. You did? But why? Why would you do that for me? I'm a nobody. A nobody? Come on, you've got to be kidding me. That's not how I see you at all. To me, you're a really important person. You're my friend. That's why I wanted to save you, even if it meant risking my life. That's the new weapon, apparently. Who's that? Don't talk to it. It's dangerous. Apparently, it doesn't even change expressions when it takes people out. I'm sure the higher-ups will use it well. I guess 
The way things stand now, there's no point in telling you. But the thing is, to me, you're you. And that is never going to change. That's why... <clears throat> What's wrong? I... I've been alone. For so long. Always somewhere dark. No one ever saw me as a person. I didn't think... I didn't think I had anyone on my side. But... But... There was someone who came and saved me. Not by chance, or on a whim. Someone came who called me a friend. I... I'm just... So glad. Honestly. <gasps> that I'm alive. Thank you. For saving me. Thank you for setting me free. <sighs> yeah. Damn it, it's already time. Wait. What? Hate to say it, but it's time for goodbye. But before I go, there's something I need to tell you. All right. Listen close. You're not Nanashi now. Hikari. Hikari Uchiha. That's the name that your parents gave you when you were born. That's your real name. Live your life in a new place in the sunlight. Also, there's something that I want you to know about the ninja world. It isn't only suffering. Listen, we might not be together, but we'll always be friends. Remember, you're never truly alone. Don't forget, I will always, I mean always, forever, I will be on your side. Boruto. Boruto! No, don't go. Boruto! Live a happy life. Hikari Uchiha! It's morning. I think I have a mission today. Where are you meeting? Hmm? Hidden Leaf Gate. Then don't be late. OK. 
Okay, I'm heading out. Take See care. You later. It's been a while since we got together like this. Only for you, Konohamaru. You've been gone on another mission this whole time, huh? We received some information about a certain underground organization, and we did a clean sweep. Underground organization? What did they say again? They called themselves Zero. It seems like they had a lot of plans, but we were able to take them down pretty quickly. We had Sasuke's help, too. What? Dad was there, too? Yeah. I think he said he'd be returning home soon. Yay! <laughs> well, well, look how happy you are. What's wrong with a daughter being happy to see her father? Nothing. It's just that you usually don't act that way. What about you? I bet you'll be happy to see my dad, too. <laughs> yeah. I wonder what he'll teach me next. Since I'm trying to follow in his footsteps, I suppose I really want to be able to use all his jutsu. So I think the next jutsu I'll have him teach me is... <laughs> what? I was just thinking that you're even more cheery than usual. Oh, you too, Mitsuki? His voice seems lighter somehow. Did something happen? Hmm? Mm, no, not especially. What? You just got cheerier for no reason. Yeah, it's strange for me too. When I woke up this morning, I just naturally had this warm feeling inside me. What? I don't get it. Hey, I don't know either. Konohamaru sensei, Boruto is being weird. Hey! Honestly, you guys really do get along. How, How is, is this getting, getting along? <laughs> now, that's enough small talk. Time to head to our mission. Okay. Let's get this done quick so I can get ready to see my dad. Boruto, Mitsuki, let's do this. Right. Sure thing. Then let's go. What's wrong? Nothing. I thought the sun was warmer than usual today. Really? Okay, let's go. Looks like it's gonna be a busy day. I'm coming in. Hmm? We're ready for the meeting. Let's get going. What? Is it that time already? What are you reading? A scroll. I found it in the library just a little while ago. It contains an account of some of the things that happened behind the scenes. Back during the Warring States period. And why are you reading it? Well, there's something really interesting written at the end of it. So they brought it to me to check. What is it? You need to come look at it later. I have no idea why he's mentioned in it. What? This is a record of a girl who escaped the bonds of the Uchiha clan during the Warring States period and went on to live a life unconnected to any clan. The girl was once used as a weapon. However, one night during a full moon, she made the decision to escape the clan. She found a new name and a new life. After gaining her freedom, she would never be used for war again. She lived modestly, enjoying the sunshine and lived a happy life. With the trees and grass, calmed by the flowing rivers and surrounded by people, 
embracing normality. She almost never spoke of her past, but she would happily tell everyone about one incident in particular. We shall record a section of her anecdote here. In my days of being used as a weapon, I had nothing to live for as a person. During this time, surrounded by eternal darkness, a young ninja suddenly appeared and taught me about fate. His words of encouragement still give me light to this day. I haven't been able to reunite with him. I don't even know where he came from. That's why... I choose to believe that the joy of deciding my own fate... ...and my gratitude for happiness... ...will one day reach him. I will bestow these feelings to the sunlight. ...so that they may one day... ...reach my friend... ...Boruto Uzumaki.